All right, so we're gonna start the morning off with a little top water action. We've got an extremely low tide. I will link the tide chart up above. So I'm expecting these fish to pull off a little bit. And right here, you can see we got a bunch of uh, simmers, grass, and all this poo poo caca. So I'm gonna start right here with throwing a frog. Actually, I might be punching this too. Time for the plopper. You know, I can say I don't, man, I don't think I've caught anything on a plopper all year so far, which is strange because normally oh, that's a money maker right there. But right now I'm only sitting in three feet of water. I'm damn near in the middle of the channel. Not a lot of current either, so these fish could push up pretty far. I just don't want to get this plopper hung up on a ton of grass like I just did. See, I kind of like these areas like this where there's a lot of current break. Uh, tools. Yeah. Oh, there's a bite. Got him. Come on, little guy. Come on, little guy. He's stuck in the weeds. That's a little guy. You really wanted that worm, didn't you, little guy? All right, number one. Yep, like I said, they're gonna be in the grass. Oh, I barely had you. Get that grass out of there first. Mm, I had you pretty good. You've been caught before. Little, little, little. Probably not even a keeper. Chatter against these rocks. I think chatter baits are kind of played out of the delta. Fish are too used to them now. They used to be like the go-to bait, but now I see less and less people using them. Just overkill. They still catch fish, but just not like they used to. There's some pipes going into the water over there that kind of interests me too. We got about eight and a half feet right here, so that's good. It's been a minute since I had a bite. I forget what a bite feels like. Time is 8.40. So I'd say it's almost been about two hours since our last fish. Real, real slow morning. Slowest morning I've had in, I can't remember, a long time. Ooh, almost fell. You'd think there'd be a fish around that pipe. Just holding right there. Got one. It's swimming right at me. Could be a decent one. No, it's a small one. It's a small one. Safe to say this guy wasn't going anywhere. He was pretty locked on. Number two, clone of the first one. Very small fish. Number two. They gotta get bigger than this. They gotta get bigger than this. All right, bye little guy. I'll see ya. Bye. All right, I'm fishing this wall right here. Should be able to catch a couple off this wall. I'm hoping at least. Then it goes into a nice dock right there for shade. I'm in 11 feet right here. Keep getting little nibbles. The problem I'm having today is they're biting me once and they're not biting me a second time. So they're not giving me the opportunity to really set the hook. So I gotta be quick with it. I like that the wind picked up though, it's nice. It breaks up this heat a little bit. So I'm not getting bit out here in deeper water where it's like 10, 11 feet. I'm getting bit in the shallows up there by this wall. I can't say that I've ever been down this slough this far. I kind of like it, I mean, it's different. 
I don't know it that well. I know that this will take you back into uh, Frank's track, follow it all the way. I, there's a rock wall. I have a feeling there's a good nine feet. Okay, so it's still fairly deep. I don't even need to do anything with my anchor. It's good. Okay, so I'm going to throw my warm out a couple times. Right there, right at the rock. See if I can produce a bite. These hot days are tough, man. I wasn't getting a bite. I'm going to try this dock now. I'm going to start hitting these pilings. All I'm doing is just snapping my rod and just making that worm flutter and fall. Oh, there's a bite. It's small. It's small. Are you gonna bite me again? Bite me one last time so I can set the hook. I don't feel good about this one. I can't tell if it has it or not. No. So I, have it and I am moving. Why am I moving? I got a damn 10 pound anchor. And I like this spot. Okay, I want to try to cast it right in. Perfect. God, that's money. Got him. Another small one. The little ones are so aggressive. I knew they'd be living on this wall, but I thought that maybe I could get a better one. God, he really got this. I don't want to whip your mouth, buddy. Let's give each other a five, buddy. All right guys, so I'm gonna call it a day here. Wow, hot, 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 hot. My feet are roasting. Um, I was unsuccessful finding any fish of size. Um, the fish I did catch seven to eight feet of water in you know, summer grass. I was using worms. I didn't have any luck on top water this morning. I don't know, maybe it's just so damn hot the fish are undercover and uh, lethargic and not chasing bait. I did have a couple uh, followers on spinner baits, so that might be a player in the morning here, but I'm at Bethel Island today. It's hot. It's hot. Stay indoors. Don't come out here. Come out in the evening if you're going to fish. And um, if you haven't already, be sure to give me a follow because it helps me out a lot. Thanks, guys. Until next time.